Upang maituro pa sa ating mga kababayan ang iba pang aspeto ng blockchain technology, isang NFT Metaverse GameFi 2022 ang isinagawa sa Pasay City. Layo nitong makapagbigay ng damang edukasyon sa mga Pilipino na tumatangkilig sa mga play-to-earn game at nais na pasukin ang larangan ng crypto. Si Erlo Bringa sa detalye. Mula nang magsimula ang pandemya na uso ng mga digital wallet, ito ang naging daan ng marami para gawin lahat ang uri ng transaksyon. Pero sa kayo, na uso ng mga play-to-earn game gamit ang cryptocurrency. Pero sa kabila nito, meron din kakibat na responsibilidad ang pagtangkilik sa mga ganitong game application. Kaya para makapagbigay pa ng tamang edukasyon, inilunsad ang isang aktibidad na tinawag na NFT Metaverse Game Fight 2022 event sa bansa na kung saan nagtipon-tipon ng mga play-to-earn game developers, crypto enthusiasts, mga eksperto at mga kabilang sa blockchain community. Ang nasabing event ay lang makapagbigay ng karagdagang edukasyon patungkol sa NFT at crypto na kasalukoy ang mas naging kilala nitong panahon ng pandemya. So it really helps a lot of Filipinos when it comes to the unemployment uh, during pandemic. So this creates a lot of opportunities, jobs, and a whole lot. Education is important, right? But when it comes to collaboration, that's what we're into. That's the reason why we accepted all of the projects to enter here. Kasabay ng aktibidad ay ang launching din ng mga bagong play-to-earn game application sa bansa na ilan sa mga ito ay Pinoy ang nag-develop. Ayon sa mga Pinoy founder at CEO ng mga nasabing game application, bukod sa paglulunsad ng kanika nila mga play-to-earn app, ay sinisiguro nilang magiging secured ito at hindi matutulad sa nausong play-to-earn app na napabalitan itong mga nagdaang buwan at araw na kung saan nahak ang mga accounts at crypto wallet ng mga user nito. This actually gives an eye-opener. Not to the, you know, I mean to the to the mass people, and they were able to have an experience playing apps, yeah. have a touch on the wallet, and at least for for those uh, incidents, they were able to have uh, an understanding for sure how does the crypto works and how they were able to do like transactions of P2P. Good to start at the play to earn project, but make sure to do your due diligence to investigate the project, know the background of the owners and the team that they are credible in doing this project. Pinoy is one of the top most players in the P2E industry and we're here to develop a game that will be a proud Filipino project. Kasama din sa paglulunsad ng Play to Earn Game app sa bansa ang mga foreign founders, CEO. Ayon sa kanila, nais nilang makapagturo sa mga Pinoy ng tamang paggamit ng NFT at crypto upang maging mas maayos at hindi ito maawi sa pagkaskam. Actually, the success in the Philippine market works as an indicator of a successful P2E. So, I mean, it's an honor to be showcasing our game in the Philippine market. And since there's a so high expectation, I think stab stability, uh, well-circulated ecosystem is the key. I think the more interest that goes into blockchain technology, the more the market will grow. I mean, obviously, naturally, the security, the regulation, the right regulation will come in. Upang mapulawak pa ang kanilang information and dissemination sa mga Pinoy, balak ng organizer ng NFT Metaverse event na makapag-tie up na rin sa Department of Information and Communications Technology o DICT para mapalawak pa nila ang kanilang mga paraan para may turo sa mga Pilipino ang tamang paggamit ng NFT at crypto maging ang mga pasikot-sikot sa nasabing larangan. The reason why um, I'm one of the women in blockchain for the Philippines So the ICT also have a segment for that. So we already have a program for us to educate a lot of Filipinos. Again, you have to understand the risk of the market because these games are pegged onto the market. These tokens are pegged onto the market. So you really have to understand first the fundamentals and second the technical of the market. Don't be afraid uh, hearing a lot of rug pulls, scam project out there. It's better to educate ourselves and this is a new financial freedom for us and I hope that you guys look for a good and legit project out there. Erlo Bingas para sa mata ng agila, matatag, tapa, matapat.